Hey, I'm Ash from Dirt in My Shoes and welcome to my home. I want to take you on a little tour and show you all of my favorite national park things so that you can get some ideas for the people in your life who love the national parks. Let's go. It's a scientific fact that the best way to calm down a stressed out type A person is to make them do a puzzle. That is probably why my husband keeps buying me national park puzzles, but I do really like this Olympic one. Can one ever have too many books? I don't think so. These national park books fit in perfectly with my plethora of fantasy and historical romance books. This map has all of the national parks and it comes with push pins so you can keep track of where you've been. I also added the string to map out our routes when we were full-time RVers. Every national park adventure loves to display their travel photos and this is my favorite way to display mine. So these are called photo tracks and you put these black things on your wall, you can move them around, you can make whatever shape you want, and then you just have to place them once and then you slide your photos in and out. So it makes it really easy to change things around and it's a really fun way to display your travel photos. We national park people really love our national park t-shirts and this is my closet. My husband shares it too, I guess, but it's full of national park shirts like this one, and this one, and this one, and this one, and this one. Who doesn't want to make hot chocolate in one of these beauties? This National Parks cookbook is really fun for trying to recreate recipes at home. I really like this one for popovers from Acadia National Park. If you can make them at home, then you don't have to spend $5 for a lot of air and just a little bit of bread. And this one, and this one, and this one. I buy one of these National Park calendars every year, and this is where I like to put our upcoming National Park vacations. They just keep popping up on here. I first fell in love with these Explorer maps when I was in Banff and I saw one in a gift shop and since then I've bought a few but my favorite is Grand Teton because that's the best national park ever. I burn this candle while I'm working and it makes me less sad to not be in a national park. I'm biased because I wrote this, but if you want a done for you plan for exploring a national park, Dirt in My Shoes itineraries are the best thing out there. A national park themed game is a really fun way to spend time with your family while also reminiscing about all the national parks you visited. And this one, and this one, and this one, and this one. Darn tough socks are my favorite socks for hiking. Look how cute they are. And they are so comfortable, I never get blisters. This is a pass that gets people into the national parks for an entire year. And so you pay the fee one time, it's $80. And then you can go to as many national parks as you want with this pass. I love this pass. I always buy it every year. It saves us a ton of money. And if you have a friend or family member that loves the national parks, they will absolutely love having this pass. Our kids take these everywhere. The quality is just so, so, but they love taking their own photos while we're out hiking. As an avid hiker, Gregory Day Packs are my favorite. I've tried so many different types of backpacks and when I'm exploring the national parks, these are the ones I use. I love them so much, I keep buying more. These blankets are really cozy and they have super fun national park designs. 